Great products, low prices, helpful service. That's Harris Ace Hardware. Harris Ace is your place for Yeti coolers, Traeger grills, Costa de Mar sunglasses, Calcutta Renegade coolers, plus Harris Ace is your hometown dealer for yellow wood treated lumber. Harris Ace will not be undersold on price, so you know you're getting the best price at Harris Ace. Your favorite place for hardware and lumber supplies is Harris Ace Hardware, West Cherry Street in Jessup. It's time now for the latest in local sports. We know the Braves are hosting St. Louis Cardinals this Thursday in Atlanta for game one of the playoff series, but as of now, we still don't have the official time, but we'll have it tomorrow on local sports as after tonight's game between Milwaukee and Washington, the National League wildcard game, they'll set the times of those matchups. Again, the winner of tonight's game gets to take on the L.A. Dodgers while the Atlanta Braves host the St. Louis Cardinals. Braves play the best of five series Thursday and Friday in Atlanta. Travel day Saturday, game three Sunday in St. Louis. And all those times will be set as soon as tonight's game is completed. The American League wildcard game set for Wednesday night, Oakland and Tampa. Again, as soon as we get the official time at Braves Cardinals, and we'll have it for you here tomorrow on local sports. Monday night football last night, Steelers win their first game of the season, beat the Bengals 27-3. And after years of writing, the George High School Association has finally read one of my letters. The GHSA announced Monday that this year in high school baseball playoffs, if you have home field advantage and the series goes to a game three, no more coin tosses. You are the home team in game three. So thank you, GHSA. You're finally waking up, realizing that's what home field advantage means. No more coin tosses. Home field is home field. Game three in baseball playoff series this year. Again, you'll be the home team. This week, the varsity girls softball team headed to South Effingham tomorrow to determine whether or not they head into next week's state tournament as a three or four seed. Lost round of one to Statesboro last week on two shutout games. This week, they're traveling Wednesday to South Effingham. Winner gets the three seed. Loser ends up number four. Both have to travel next week in round one. A couple of middle school scores in softball yesterday. Arthur Williams, 14. Waycross, 0. Apton County, 11. Martha Puckett, 4. Recreation scoreboard from last night. A couple of midget football games. Gators, 32. Jackets, 0. Long County, 30. Kane, 0. And soccer in U10. Griffin, 6. Odom, 0. Darley, 2. Wingate, 0. Rutherford, 4. Cruz, 0. Bell, 3. Kagey, 0. In U12. Farrell, 3. Darley, 1. Banks, 8. Spell, 2. Hilton, 5. Tyre, 0. In Youth, 14. Copeland, 5. Fergal, 0. And that's your recreation scoreboard. Finally, in sports, WFOFM talked with school superintendent Jay Brinson Monday to get an update on the ugly incident that occurred last week at the middle school football game as the two head coaches after the game got involved in altercation. Superintendent Brinson says it's a sad situation, but investigation has been underway since that incident took place. Many people interviewed, statements given. Superintendent says both school employees are entitled to due process, but the superintendent says once the investigation is completed, the superintendent will be making the final and ultimate decision on what takes place at that time. This time, both employees have been suspended from their respective schools. That's going to do it for the latest in local sports. Sports is brought to you each and every day at this time by your friends at Harris Ace Hardware. When you have an accident, you, not the insurance company, chooses the body shop, and you only need one estimate. All you have to do is call Jerome Riles at BNC Collision Center in downtown Scriven to deal with the adjusters and insurance company. Whether it's a little ding or a major crash, that BNC Collision Center across from Wazden Cabinet Shop in Scriven deal with the insurance company so you don't have to.